how to embed Canva newsletter in email. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can embed a Canva newsletter into your emails and send them. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over canva.com. Then you need to sign in into an account and this platform because it will not work without an account. So right here, we have the platform or the landing page of Canva. So now we are going to search for a uh, uh, template for the newsletter. You can go ahead and create it manually if you know the size and the uh, correct size uh, of your uh, newsletter. You can go ahead and click on custom size put the width and the height for example and choose the uh, perfect unit for you or you can go ahead and get some pre-made templates by clicking on the search tab right there and typing only news letter then click enter and here we have the designs that we have created this is uh, or these are the recent designs that i have created and also we have uh, the Canva templates for the newsletter. As you can see, the format or the dimension and also the size are the same for each one of them. We have a format of right there, as you can see, 21 centimeters by 29.7. And if I click on this one, we have the same one. So the uh, unit uh, that are used for creating newsletters are the centimeters and we have only a one dimension which is 21 by 29.7 so we are going to choose whatever uh, here uh, template that we want i want to use a much simpler template for example let's go ahead and use maybe this one like that or this one so we are going to click on this, click on customize and boom, here we have the template ready. So here we have the template. As you can see, everything is designed and everything is set already. So we need to remove these watermarks because they are for paid pictures, also for paid content. We're going to set, for example, photo graphy. So we are going to see here some pictures and we are going to add a vertical picture. So let's go ahead and add a picture that is suitable for this. So we are going to add it like that, make it a little bit, um, not like that, but it's okay. So we are going to make it like this to uh, pre-vision everything right there. So here we have it uh now for this cake it is very delicious i don't um i don't want to ruin it so we are going to make this here we are going to add some titles instead of these uh, nonsense uh text for example here how to get the perfect or perfect uh, photo for example this is uh, the title. You can go ahead and make it like that. Make it a little bit smaller to uh, fit right away like that. Here we have a subtitle. So we can go ahead uh, and put here our a little article. Little article about uh, on how to do that. On how to do that then you are going to set up for example i'm going to uh, put it like that this is uh, more convenient you can go ahead and put uh, for example the elements uh, more lighting lighting lightning not lightning but lighting and here we are going to set a, a great for example, lens. Boom. So we are going to set this. Then we need to only click on share. The first thing that we need to do is to click on uh, download. 
then we are going to uh, set it right there as a PNG. Download it as a PNG. This is the first step that you need to do. Then we are going to import it to our right there Gmail. So we are on our Gmail account. I'm going to uh, click on compose. A little disclaimer, guys, everything created in this video, such as email addresses, phone numbers, or Google accounts are created for the sake of the video. They are not used for any personal uses. So keep that in mind and use your own information. So here we are going to or going to set the recipient to the subject, for example, monthly newsletter, newsletter. And here we have the text. So I am going right there to add the picture. We're going to add it right away here. So wait for it to be uploaded. In the meanwhile, I'm going back right here to Canva. Then we are going, let's say, to create another page right there. So uh, we are going to add another page like this one, maybe. So we are going to add the first one and we are going to add another one. And here we have the third one. So we have in total four right there picture or four newsletters. So all we need to do right there is to click on share again. Then we are going to get a public link. So we need to click on public view link. Then we are going to create the public view link again and boom. So if you want to check this newsletter or read it, you're going to get this link that will allow you to see this specific newsletter. The, the viewer can share it or they can zoom it. They can do whatever they want from here apart from uh, modifying it because they don't have the right to modify it. Uh, you are going to, if you want to edit or modify the document, it is up to you because you are the owner. So as you can see here, we have the logo right there. Now we have the uh, newsletter. So we are going back right there to the inbox. So all we need to do is to get the cursor from here. We are going to click with the left click of the mouse, keep clicking. Then we are going to uh, slide over the left. As you can see, the newsletter has been selected. So all we need to do right there is to link it. So we can go ahead and link it right there. So we are going to click on the uh, link right there, insert link. Here we have it. Click on it. And now the text to display. You can go ahead and uh, display a text. For example, uh, I'm going to set newsletter here, uh, monthly uh, newsletter, maybe like that to or link to a website, of course. And here we are going to simply type or paste the website that we've got from Canva. As you can see right there, it is only a canva.com slash design. Click on OK. Then boom, here we have it. This is how we can embed the um, newsletter. This is the first picture. So we are going to uh, send it to ourselves. I'm going to set Jack, Jack Smith, and this is the same account. I'm going to send it and boom, here we have it. So this is the newsletter. We are going to wait for the picture to load up because it is a very loaded picture and boom. So if I want to click on it, I will go ahead and see it right away in here. This is the newsletter. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.